it going? Today we're gonna to go over how to draw a Chipotle burrito. Uh, it's gonna be simple, easy, step-by-step -step for beginners. So pretty much it, very, very short lesson. So stay all the way to the very end and that's it. So let's hop in, all right? First thing I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna start with kind of the tortilla area of the burrito. So I'm gonna curve right through that folding over burrito. Curve up over here. I'm gonna do all the insides of the burrito first. So right now it's gonna be like this little bumpiness right here. See that bumpiness? It's funny because I'm trying to do all these like simple items. So like, let me know what other simple items you want me to see me do, like a burrito or something like that, some inanimate objects. I wanna do a lot of those. I wanna make the full list of those. Alrighty, so I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna, so it's kind of a lip of the burrito, the, the, the tortilla, and I'm gonna pull the line down. Over here on this side, pull line down. Alrighty. And now there's always this foil paper kind of around here. Uh, the reason I do this also is I eat tons and tons and tons of Chipotle. If you guys wanna sponsor me, let me know, Chipotle. So I'm gonna go right here and have this crinkly tin foil kind of thing going on. Same thing on this side. Same thing over here on this side. And it's gonna be peeling over the top, so I'm gonna go right here, put it down there, like so. So it's kind of like it's folded over, right? Like it's folded over, crunched over. And these are more or less random shapes right here. Just crunchy, just make it angular like that, like crunchy. <laughs> I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna continue this uh, length of the burrito here and I'm gonna pull down and then make it crunchy as well. But you know, there's, it's obviously filled out with burrito. Line over here. It's gonna come to the opening of that. It's gonna go curl over the side, you know? By the way, like, let me know your favorite foods. It's kind of fun to, to do that. And if you like learning how to do that, you're gonna love subscribing to the channel. So absolutely hit subscribe, click the bell notification if you like learning how to draw stuff because it absolutely is the best thing ever for you, just like burritos. Um, you know, give me that one. Give me that uh, little, uh, what do you call it? That segue. I'm gonna go over here, same thing, making it crunchy, but keeping that fullness of the burrito. So I'm gonna assist, so it's always gonna be a crunchy edge. But like I said, it has more shape going on than there. <sighs> Let's go over here and draw maybe some cheese. It's gonna be uh, represented by uh, like these lines right here. Like so. Then we're gonna go over here on this side and, and do maybe some meat. It's gonna be mo mostly just another layer right there. Think of like a cloudy layer, pretty much, right? So there's gonna be reflections off the tin foil. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna draw another line, kind of similar, also crunchy, along this edge here. It's gonna make it look like the reflectiveness of um, tin foil. So, and I'm gonna make this line a little thicker because I want it to make it look like, uh, you know, like that reflective surface. So I'm gonna make it a little bit thicker, this line, whatever it may look like to you, you know, on yours, right? Absolutely just kind of like, just thicken it out.
like so. And uh, you can throw as much of that as you want around the tin foil area because it's always going to give it like a like a little bit of a reflective look. You know, you can draw. You can make one real thick over here, like on one side. It should give it a little bit of a little bit of a look right there. And if you want in the middle here, you could throw a couple of more things right here. And line right here. <clears throat> All right. All right. So now I'm gonna do is I'm gonna draw a thicker line on the outside, and that's gonna to be to just kind of make the whole thing look a little bit like a sticker. Speaking of stickers, I'm gonna start selling stickers on this page, so keep a lookout for that. I am going to kind of announce that soon, so. continue to do that don't forget to hit the like by the way if you like any of these food ones i'm gonna do a lot more of them you just gotta let me know okay absolutely fun times that's pretty much it uh so i want to thank you very much if you also you can put some dots on the tortilla here very easy i think Thank you so much, I appreciate it. Uh, what I want you to do is I want you to, if you wanna support the channel, there's two things you can do. You can share the video um, on pretty much anywhere you want, or you can donate to the channel. But the, the easiest one, the free one, would be to share the video anywhere, like anywhere with a friend, with, on Reddit, on Twitter, just press that auto share button and it's gonna share it somewhere and it'll be, you know, uh, you know, big thanks to the channel. Thank you so much, you guys are awesome. I post three times a day, I'll see you later this afternoon skills go right here to this video on here on this side um, that video I put because it's the exact same theme as the video you just saw and it kind of I like it as a bit of a pair so absolutely go check that out right now another short video